How's it going, guys? 3% Ninja here, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. And you know what, guys? Sometimes it seems like all roads lead to Hogsmeade. <laughs> I swear he says it every single time. But we are actually in Hogsmeade because we got stuff to do. We got this mission here, which is helping out this goblin. I was about to say, I was about to call him an elf. I was literally about to call him an elf. <laughs> How about this goblin over here? Because I think... Doing this mission would allow us to own our own store, eventually. I think so. Not entirely certain. Oh, hold on. Let's get a little bit of money first. It's like the easiest money you can get. Oh, wait, where is it? Ah, oh, I put the spell away? Oh, I don't like that at all. Okay, let's put that spell back. Because we're going to be turning invisible all the time. Hold on. Where is it? How come I can't move? That was weird. Alright, what we're we going to put away though? What we're we going to put away? This. Easy four, uh, $500. Hello? Is something the matter? Most decidedly, yes. My precious moon calf biscuit was abducted by poachers up north. Oh, the vicious brutes. I tried to fight back, but I was no match for them. I'm sorry about your moon calf, Mr. Garnath. Just Garnath. I'm only one goblin. Not a particularly brave one at that. I have no chance against a pack of bloodthirsty poachers. Oh, my poor biscuit. I can only hope she's able to escape. Oh, man. Okay, so Biscuit's a moon calf. And, of course, I'm the hero looking like freaking Neo from <laughs> uh, The Matrix. Why would a poacher Why want your moon calf? the poachers took Biscuit? I have no idea. Moon calf dung's highly valuable for fertilizing magical plants. But I cannot imagine poachers care much about gardening. Who knows what they'll do to her? She could be flog skinned, gutted, and stuffed. I assume. Oh, biscuit. You know, she could probably be made into a biscuit as well. Uh, why do you have a pet moon calf? A moon calf is an unusual pet. Why did you choose biscuit? She followed me one evening. I wouldn't leave my side. Never thought I was one for a pet of any kind. But now I can't imagine life without her. Moon calves are often thought of as silly, simple minded creatures. But I've seen great depth of character in Biscuit. I wouldn't trade her for a hippogriff or a hippopotamus, or even a goose that lays golden eggs. Okay, if I'm going to take you seriously, you got to stop telling me the name is Biscuit. I'll keep an eye <laughs> off your moon calf, Garneth. How kind. If only all of Wizard Kind was as gracious to goblins. If you do see her and can bring her safely home to me, I promise to reward you for your efforts. All right. Keep an eye out for her, and be careful out there. Poachers are an unscrupulous lot. Let's go get Biscuit. Garnish moon calf. Sounds as if I'd need to head north to find those poachers. Said north. I should get out of town first. Um, it's going to be this way. Why is it taking me the other way? The poachers are this way. Oh, I think it's trying to take me to like the main quest or something. Can I fly now? Still can't fly. You gotta get really far. Right, how about this? Let me pass this signpost. Hogs me to here I come. Alright. That's usually what the this person got a mission as well? Pardon me? Might I ask a favor of you? Um, sure, but I'm already on a mission. Hello, is there something I can help you with? How do you do? I'm Sacrosa Tugwood, and I have an exciting business proposition for you. Now, it may surprise you to learn that someone of my obvious esteemed lineage would be in business. But, I only want to help the less fortunate. Okay, how condescending. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, 
sure. I was say, how genuinely that's kind. That's incredibly nice of you. Oh, there's more. You see, I've been experimenting with a new beauty cream. A cream that will rid our glorious school of the hideous, greasy pustules plaguing our poor pubescent classmates. But I've run out of the key ingredient, Booba Chuba Pus. Oh my god. How do they come up with these names? If only I could pay someone to collect a few for me. Booba Tuba. Alright. <laughs> really? I can't I can't take it seriously. Booba tuber? Booba tuber? Really? What precisely are Booba Tubers? Disgusting things, really. Covered in protrusions. One needs to squeeze them to collect the pus. They smell simply awful and seem to move on their own. Ugh. I wouldn't go near the things if it weren't for my devotion to my classmates. How do you know about Booba Tuba Pus? How on earth did you discover that Booba Tuba Pus clears one's skin? One cannot rely on spells for all appearance enhancements. The errant cast, for example, could relocate one's eyebrows entirely rather than merely thinning them. My darling and now perpetually surprised looking neighbor discovered that on her own. Poor thing. I am convinced that beauty potions are the future. I'm forever looking for ways to make this world a more beautiful place. I suspected that if pure booba tuba pus could cause boils, an altered form would likely reverse such abominations. And I was correct. All right, but she, you know, she's a bit condescending, but she's smart. So there's that. I can try and find some for you if I have the time. Marvelous. I'd go myself, but I don't want to. I oh. <laughs> a few creatures, but they grow wild, so you'll have to look around. Yo, that's the most realistic. I've got a classmate to count on you, so you mustn't tarry. <laughs> that's got to be the most realistic uh, answer I've ever heard any character in any game ever say. Every time when somebody gives you a quest, it's some like because of this, because of like a legitimate reason or whatever. But she's just like, I will go, but I just don't want to. <laughs> so you do it for me. I still can't fly. Holy hell. Get me out of here. Just get me out of town. How am I still in it? Oh, hold on. Since I'm already here. more cozy than have a look around. I'll be with you in just a minute. Might as well buy these. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Yeah, that's all I need. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. I won't. I think I got everything that I ever could want from you, to be honest. Unless you give me some new stuff. Can I fly now? Holy! How far do you have to get away from town? How's this? There's even balloons in the air. Wow! <laughs> That's crazy! Okay, let's get this. Okay, there's only two? I'm about to say there's gotta be more. Uh, there's a mission down there. I'm not gonna do that yet. Let's work one at a time, shall we? There's some more balloons as well. I've seen there have been a boss enemy below me as well. Poachers. God, if it was right then, I'd better be careful. Be careful, just. She's gonna beat them up. Is that literally just one? Rebellion. Where's all the balloons? Oh, whatever. Oh, there it is. It's like literally hiding. Yeah, I don't see any others. There you are. Is 
It should just okay. be one more. I can't stop now. Wow. If I don't find this, I wouldn't I was about to say I never will. Okay. Time to fight. Or I could get rid of some. Must be hearing things. Must have been the wind. <laughs> this is way too easy. I should not be doing it this way. But I mean, I'm going to keep going. <laughs> Maybe I'll fight the last one. Okay. I'll fight the last one only because I need to, um... How do I... I need to use this. The Thunder Brew. Okay. Fight me! Don't kill you yet! Nice. The beasts are safe now. That was way too easy. Okay, stealth is overpowered. A little more. They're really gonna make me do this? It's still thundering. <laughs> Yo, Thunder Brew is so good. Holy hell. It's still going. Which one of you is Biscuit? Uh... How would I know? What the... Rebellion. Well, they're just gone. So... <laughs> really? Rescue Biscuit? I'm already at the destination. So one of them was Biscuit. Um, I think I need to use the bag here. Do I literally just rescue all of them? Come here. Too far away. No, you don't. Come on. Professor Howard will never believe this. I literally just caught the <laughs> just a random one. That was biscuit. I think. It still says rescue biscuit, so Maybe I should have took them before I even opened up the gate. I found Biscuit in a large pen containing Mooncast and Poacher of Catcher. I just need to unlock the cage and rescue her. Okay. So maybe that wasn't Biscuit. It's still showing this area as purple. Okay, I think you are a biscuit. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Everything's all right now. 
No. I guess that wasn't Biscuit. This is... Rebellion. Annoying. <laughs> oh, really? Do cooperate, won't you? There's some some flying freaking things out here. Okay, yeah, this is um, probably one of the most annoying quests. I can't believe this is the first quest I decided to do. Uh, where is it? It's over here somewhere. Is it inside? Oh, hello. Are you in some sort of trouble? Nearly attacked by wolves, I was. Only just escaped with my life. I need to be better prepared next time. Could use some thunder brew. I don't suppose a student like yourself will be in possession of such a thing? I literally just used it. I'm afraid not. I'd help you if I could, but I don't actually have anything with me. Well, that is unfortunate. I was hoping you'd be better prepared. All right, then. I guess when I have Thunder Brew, I'll come back here. <laughs> I literally just used it. Actually, can I just, like, craft some? No, I need shriveling something. Rebellion. I guess uh, I'm just going to be capturing these guys. That's my lot in life. It's not you. You're like a whole different color. Control three. There's one. Let me I'm just gonna capture them all. I look after you. Rebellion. It sounds like I got them every single time too. Oh, you must be him. Let me go. Oops. Let's get you back to Gonev, shall we? Got him. Just fly me there. I mean, teleport me. Map? Where's he at? Over here. I think. Isn't it? It's not in Hogsmeade? Speak to Dorothy. I want to say it is in Hogsmeade. There is so many quests in this game. <laughs> it's crazy. But it adds to the longevity of the game, though. It always makes you want to come back and do more. I shall sort something out. Goneth, I've rescued Biscuit. You have? Oh, is she hurt? Was she frightened? Are you all right? <laughs> we are both fine. Biscuit is fine, as am I. I was able to rescue her without much incident. Oh, mercy. Where poachers are concerned, I tend to expect the worst. I cannot wait to get her home. I so miss seeing her dance in the evenings. Such joy. I'm sure she'll be glad to be home. I would like to be um, 
and she's safer with me. <laughs> I would like to be compensated for my you efforts. Can have her back for the right price. What? I, of course. I would pay any amount for the safety of my dear biscuit. Oh, my sweet little biscuit. My wise, noble moon calf. And here is your reward, of course. Well deserved. As I said before, you have restored my faith in wizard kind. <laughs> oh, good. At least a modicum of my faith in wizard kind. Biscuit and I can't thank you enough. I honestly didn't think he would be like, I'm holding him hostage. <laughs> I thought it'd be like, hey, I did a lot of work, so can I get compensated for it? <laughs> okay, let me see here. What else we have? We have that mission that we accepted from the lady um, with the skin condition, I guess. Spot removal, was it? Told me I said expect some, yeah, booba tubers. And then a friend in need. There's so much to do. Alright, let's go get the booba tubers. Of course, I gotta leave town once more. You know what? How about we just fast travel out of town? That way we don't have to run, like, a really long distance. I'm out. Okay, now where is this mission? It's over here, it looks like. I'm looking forward to getting another upgrade to the broom. This is where Sakurissa said to go. And where are those booba tubers? Yeah, this is like the exact place. Okay, booba... Whoa, what the... Just my luck, troll. Hello. <laughs> the troll is just chilling and I'm just like, take that. <laughs> Take the brick, son. <laughs> I just came in this guy's house and just like take these hands. Oh, nope, goodbye. Doesn't matter what level they are. Oh, that smells awful. Only four more, thank goodness. Four? Rebellion. They must all be here. She didn't say collect four, did she? Is this it? Yeah. Look like just like a regular mushroom.
Booba tuber. Oh, that's like actually hidden. Okay, there should be just one more over there. Oh. That should do it. I'd better get back to Sakarissa now. They're over here fighting. Are you winning, son? <laughs> Did she lose? Looks like she lost. My turn. You got no aim. You gotta do better than that, son. You're not hitting me with this. <laughs> He's tired. <laughs> Too easy. I did not need to fight these guys. So they put the health back on. Where is it actually? Endurance, Venomous, Maxima, Focus, Thunderbrew, Invisibility. Oh, I use health differently. Okay, yeah, that's right. With a different button. Okay, I think we're done here. In fact, I did a little extra. The flying is so cool. I'd rather be on the broom than on the, um, all oh, right. Sometimes it seems all roads, all lead, roads to lead to Hogsmeade. That's right. <laughs> Sakarissa, I found the book with tubers you needed. Splendid. I hope it wasn't too much trouble. May I have them? <laughs> I should do this. She is so condescending. It actually was a spot of trouble. You never mentioned I might encounter a troll. I think you should pay me more. I suppose a higher price is less offensive than being forced to regard the hideous, greasy ah! pustules plaguing <laughs> our pubescent classmates. Oh, Jesus. Thank you. And your payment, of course. Now I can begin perfecting my potion to save our poor pimply peers. Don't know who should be more grateful, I or our unsightly spotty classmates. <laughs> Yo. One day the Wizarding World will know my name, and you will have been a small part of it. A small? Hey, what's up? <laughs> She's just chilling. Uh, we're going to go to the classroom. Or at least not the classroom, but the school. Because I want to get a Thunder Brew to give to that lady in that cabin by herself. Let me see. I want to know what happens. Because she doesn't have a mission thing on her. Which makes me think it's some type of secret mission. Or she's going to just give me money or something. Guess we'll see if I can make a Thunder Brew or... No. I'm missing one thing to make a Thunder Brew. The Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. The Deke? Who calls himself like that? Didn't he leave?
fertilizer. I don't think there's anything else I can do here because I can't make the thunder brew. I need shrivel fig fruit. Well, let's start going to the classroom then, since we can't do what we wanted to do. Let's look at the missions. And we did some of the assignments. Let's learn Flipendo. Should be right here then, huh? Oops. Now you push the wrong button once and then boom, the quest is gone. You can get lost in here super easily. Oh, I'm going upstairs. Yeah, I guess so. Excuse me, fellas. Oh, it's the plant lady, I think. Yeah. Stuck, I'm stuck. No. Oh no. <laughs> okay, it looks like um, I got stuck in my track, so. Let's go ahead and teleport. At least we know where it's at. Where's the teleporting stuff? There we go. I'm free! What happened to the quest? That is so annoying. Oh, she's in there. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. <laughs> I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Damn right. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. That's cool, nerd. Well, if there's one thing I have to see more than my plants, <laughs> you're flipping though. It's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flipendo? Chin up. Keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Uh -huh. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just it's like... Mind the plants, nah, I, I want to practice, but I just don't feel like messing with the spells, to be honest. That's like the most worrisome spot. Like, I mean, part <laughs> is messing with all the, the spells. Taking it in, taking it out. Uh, let's see. We do have this to learn, so let's go ahead and learn this as well. Where are you located on the map? You are here, sir. We must have done a lot of assignments. Right way, right? Or am I going the wrong way? That picture says the same thing every single time. Is 
It's like somebody that peaked in high school and that's all they talk about is their high school life. You can't imagine how much I bettered people's lives by this teleporting spell. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous well, in your efforts. Well, well. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and... It's like they know I'm the main character. Combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. No. Too late. Let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Uh-huh, sure. <laughs> oh, it's an actual attack spell. Because it's red, right? Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would... Oh, it is an attack spell. Let's go. I want to take, I want to take that out. And uh, you know what? I'm never gonna really do this, this um, descendo. I just want all attacks. So actually, let me put this back, and it's gonna be here. Now pulling them in is still pretty good. I want to keep doing that. And I think that's it. What is this? Oh, that's that's the flip pin though. Okay, gotcha. All right, let's do one more side quest before doing the main mission here. The lost child. Huh? I'll do that later. I've never been here? Weird. Honestly, at some point, I feel like I've been everywhere in this school. Oh, that's why I've never been. Your hair, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Unfortunately, only a gaunt knows the location of the scriptorium's entrance, and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. You? But don't get your hopes <laughs> up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. Oh. He's this way. I ain't know he'd be spitting bars. I'll lead you to it and lead you to it. Oh, uh, where is... Oh. <laughs> lead the way, buddy. Never know who's watching. What the hell? Although that hasn't stopped us before. Strictly speaking, it has. We were caught. Damned poltergeist. Such a nuisance. I don't think I've ever been this way. There he is. Good luck. What are you doing here? What's up, buddy? Friend? Amigo? You know what? Uh, I think you can say the wrong stuff in this quest, so let me go ahead and save it as a just in case. I don't know where I saved it last. What's this? Oh, I said it must be here, of course. I'll save it here then. Oh, it's been two days since I played. Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? I owe you an apology, Ominous. I wasn't honest with you before about the Undercroft. Sebastian did show it to me. He wanted me to have a safe place to practice some spells, to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. I suppose that makes sense. 
It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about, what was it, a scriptorium? He told you about that. He did. We were talking about Hogwarts founders and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the answer to saving Anne. I think it's likely full of dark magic that is better left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favorite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family. Yo, I can be an actual magic. detective. In fact, she'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood status. She'd heard of this scriptorium and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. Tell she me. wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to gain access, and then she simply vanished. No one else ever tried to enter. Aren't you curious about what's inside? Um, hmm. I'll say I understand your caution. That's a bit unnerving. I suppose even if it might lead to answers about what happened to your aunt, it does pose a risk. Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honor her memory, get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Your aunt pursued this alone. We could do it together. Hmm. I see what you've done here. <laughs> I confess, you've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian, I'll wait. Hey, I let's go. We don't regret this. Sebastian, open okay. These braziers grant access to the scriptorium. Now you're Oh, really? You wouldn't tell me when I practically begged. It wasn't you to bring up what I needed to hear. Opening the entrance has something to do with threes. Well, three heads are Rebellion. better than one. It's two heads are better than one. <laughs> and by that logic, three is better than two. Simple mathematics. Simple mathematics. I want to go on these. Hello, Hamora. I've never been in this area. And it seems to be a lot of locks that I can open up. Incendium. It would not let you go far at all. I definitely can't go there. Alohomora. Oh, my head just completely turned around. Hold on. I doubt I can go very far over here. I think it just leads outside. All right, I'm back. Oh. Good for you. How long does it stay on fire? Okay, not very long. This is easy though. Incendio. We're ready for this. All right, let's do it. Dark, ominous corridors. My favorite. No comment. Come on, that was a good one. We got in Leviosa. Oops. Yo, there's so many spells. There's too many spells. Looks like a locked door. We may have to keep around. I must prove my point. We do not need to use the dark arts as my family instructs. When I reach the sectorium, I find evidence that there's more to Salazar Slytherin than we realize. I've written to my brother. He now knows how I access the corridor entrance and there is no straight path to reach the sectorium. It's a maze with many challenges to solve. I hope that my brother will follow my lead and we can study our ancestor legacy together. Naktul, grunt. The journal entry 
Huh. Signed by Noctua Gaunt. Gaunt. Ominous. Your Ominous. All right, look, we're not going to use all of these, I guess. Um, we're only going to use them when we go there, so I might as well make this into something else. And for this, I need Reparium or something like that? Leviosa? Here it is. Reparo. Oops. She was my aunt. You know? Didn't tell me. The rubble formed a relief of a person facing a snake. That must be the voice I hear. Hmm. The voice is ancient. You hear a voice. It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, speak to me. I'm a parcel mouth. I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I'd like to be able to talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak past the tongue. It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken it in ages, but I'd wager if I speak it now, the door will open. I'm hoping you're having second thoughts. <laughs> I'm hoping. None at all. Second and third thoughts. I see no reason we should stop now. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the dark arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. I can't believe I'm doing this. It worked! Ominous, you possess a rare ability indeed. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. <laughs> Between the two of us? I... Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. There's no clear way forward. Like a maze. Salazar Slytherin most likely wanted this to be difficult to solve. Incendio! The door we came from is closed, and there's more than one gate ahead. Then okay. I might want to use this because it is pretty dark. Lumos. Hmm. I wonder if there's going to be anything to fight in here. It's a snake. Right, hold on. Of course, it's a snake. Incendium. Just in case there's any torches that I don't see. The dial requires focus. Uh, not to reset the same. It may take practice to solve. Wait, what? What am I doing? That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. I don't understand. What what am I doing? Salazar Slytherin buried the subscription deep within the Hogwarts. I'm afraid I shall lose my way around these dark corridors. I am a descendant, and yet I feel unwelcome. Lighting these brazers in the corridor is helping. I shan't lose heart. Challenge my challenge. Challenge by challenge. <laughs> I will make my way through. This Gone. journal entry, it mentions getting lost and being unwelcome. Lumos. Hmm. Let's look around to see if there's any clues to what this answer is supposed to be here. Oh, well, there's the first. It looks like they're both here, but one looks like a monkey or something. And the other one just looks like a six, a weird looking six. But that must be it. All right, the one that looks kind of like a monkey this one and the weird looking six matching the symbols did open it I was about to do that myself but you got to it first <coughs> lose what of course Another note? 
extraordinary. This journal, well, this journey is painful but rewarding. I shall soon find the scriptorium and discover untold secrets regarding our house founder, Salazar Slytherin, intended more than we've become. I know it. Not sure reference is painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Painful. That's the part I'm wearing. All I heard was rewards. Keep going. <laughs> I wonder if there's any I missed. Any notes that I didn't pick up. Lumos. Oh, wait a minute. Rebellion. Oh, I must be past this then. Um, Lumos. it's another one of these. So it looks like a fish in a pyramid. We've got more to solve ahead. Search each corridor. It may not be obvious which leads where. Hmm. Do I have to do this again then? It's like a fish in a pyramid. Oh no. Guess I don't do this again. Rebellion. Oh, hold on. Ah, I see. And what is this? A sun and a serpent. Another gate. Seems Slytherin like to play games. Must run in the family. Look in the mirror, Sebastian. That's a Lumos. Another dial solved. Impressive. Nice work. I'm doing all the work. Like literally all of it. You guys can help out a little bit. I felt the Tao, and it struck my face as if I was a real serpent. But I must find a way forward for my family's sake. Oh, as if it was a real serpent. <laughs> oh, man. We should not require children to conform to old traditions. This scintur... Sc uh, scriptorium? Just think of script and then just put Torium, I suppose. Must have proof that there's more to our legacy than meets the eye. Scriptorium. Ominous. Your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did. And she was my favorite person in the world. Rebellion. Ah, I kind of forgot what the other one was. And this must be it here. Because there's no gate here. I gotta go back and look at it. Wonder what that's all about. I can hardly see. Lumos. Okay. Now this one was a fish in a pyramid. Don't worry guys. I'll do everything. Another <laughs> not the welcome sword, was he? Excellent work. We're another step closer to the scriptorium. We Lumos. Yeah, I suppose you're here physically. <laughs> okay. I spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. This whole place is troubling. Uh, Rebellion. Rebellion. We cannot stop now. Okay. You guys Again. saw that? I think we're locked in. Again. Then Salazar Slytherin is not yet finished with us. The last note. Wait, what? Oh! Repair. What am I doing? I've lost hope. I'm locked in. I heard a scream and saw the tortured faces. The only way forward is with an unforgivable curse. Even if I want, uh, wanted to cast it, I have no one upon whom to do so. Salazar Slytherin created a malicious challenge indeed. And my last correspondence to my brother. I'd invited him here. Now, if he looks for me alone, I have led him to his death. 
Despite our differences, I wish him no ill. No ill. <laughs> I wish him no ill. I wish we had parted on better terms. Ominous. A skeleton. And Noctua's last journal entry. She mentions being trapped here, blocked by an unforgivable curse. This is where she died. This is where we'll die. I shouldn't have listened to either of you. Ominous, I'm truly sorry about your aunt. But I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. We gotta say this spell. You said you know what to do. Tortured faces on the door, and Crucio is etched into the stone. My guess is if we cast the Cruciatus curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. You seem to be in Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? He does seem a bit cross with you. I'll speak with him. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. <laughs> Wish we had some liquid luck. Nice All choice of words. Been avoided. Ominous. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. I overheard you and Sebastian, and I won't do it. The Cruciatus Curse is pure torture, I would know. Sebastian told me a little Oh, what that's the one that he young. hates. Sounds as if you had no choice. Should have known he would have told you. And one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Unforgivable curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. That spells the reason I have no family left. You and Sebastian will need to sort out another solution. So he's not going to do it. Crucio, you will regret it forever. He's not going to do it. All right, guys, we are out of time. <laughs> Sorry, I got to end the episode here when things were just getting good. But I wonder if I'm going to use Crucio or if Sebastian's going to use Crucio. And who are we going to use it on? Because I'm guessing it's going to be on me. And that's going to be fine because I can just heal myself. But <laughs> it's only one way to find out. And that is going to be on the next episode, guys. If you like the video, consider dropping that like. And subscribe to see more videos just like this one. I'm 3% Ninja. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. And be good people.